So today is February 8th and there's no comedy today because I'm sick. So instead, you get to watch me make breakfast and see what I do when I'm sick. See what I do when I'm sick. What? So I pretty much eat the same thing for breakfast every single day. Eggs, bacon, cranberry juice, gotta keep it fresh. You know what I'm talking about. Um, and it's what I eat every single day. I wake up at about 5 in the morning, 5.30 in the morning, and I make myself this because it gets my day started. And I love when my day st starts out great with a nice, nice, nice eggs and bacon. So let's make it. So every morning I come down here, I take this pan right here, and I put it right there. And sometimes the gas that doesn't come out right away, so I kind of stand back because I always think that the fire is going to put me aflame. So what I do is I try to mess with it Ooh. until it gets there. Very dangerous stuff. I got my bacon right here, uh, non-organic, uh, not grass-fed. It's um, actually uh, Oscar Mayer. So the people who make hot dogs, that's what I, that's how I make my bacon. Um, I know people are probably wondering, Sam, bacon and eggs every day, are you on a keto diet? Um, no, I'm not, my sister is. I am not though, um, I just love bacon and eggs. My dad has cooked me bacon and eggs every single day from since I was in middle school, I guess. So now I got to do it. No big deal. No big deal. And on a sick day, I feel like, treat yourself. Treat hey, yourself. While the bacon is cooking, we do our eggies. Eggies. We like eggies. I like eggies. As you can tell, they are again uh, not not organic. They're not farm fed or um, I don't know, like whatever that stuff is. It doesn't seem good. <clears throat> so I got my little pan, perfect, perfect little pan for eggs, and then I got my little blue bowl. My little blue bowl. When I make eggs, I like to make them scrambled. Nothing, nothing fancy, so I use that, uh, it's a perfect pan. I could never be vegan, because I freaking love eggs. And I could never be a vegetarian, because I freaking love bacon. I love it. And now, now I'm like double wielding. I make sure everything, I never actually shake anything up like this, because you just don't do it. But you can make it seem like that's something that I do. I don't, I don't do it. I never do it. So, I always use two eggs. Two eggs are perfect for scrambled eggs. That's all you need. Oh, look how fresh that is. How fresh. What a fresh. This is gonna make me feel better. Ooh. Look at them fresh eggs. Oh. I can already taste the protein and also um, all, all of the stuff that they inject into the eggs. <laughs> Ooh, look at that. Eggy, eggy. Eggy, eggy, eggy in my belly, my roof. One thing I really hate about being sick is that when you call out of work, you have to make it seem like you're sicker than you are. Like I sound sick right now, but when I call work, I'm like, hey, that's me. I'm sick. I think I got what everybody else got. Whatever everybody else had, that's what I am. And really, I am sick. I do feel miserable. I do sound different. I sound like a guy, I sound like a dude at the gym who's like, hey, let's do some Let's get some of these muscles going, huh? Let's do some cardio. Anybody want to do some cardio? Let's get it going. 
So I still feel sick, but it's like when you're sick, you just have to be a miserable human being. I don't want to be a miserable human being. I'm sick, I'm sick, but I don't got to act like my whole day is ruined because I'm sick. I just don't want to go to work. I'd rather rest. Make videos of me making eggs. You know? What? Bacon is almost there. I like my bacon crispy. So, it's almost done. So as soon as my bacon's almost done, that's when I start to scramble the eggs. some non-stick stuff on it because the bacon's almost done what I do I grab a paper towel place it down on the counter and then I just grab these bad boys out now I always use this burner for eggs perfectly fine I don't have to worry about if this burner is gonna light my hair on fire or my face or my body it'll just turn right on so. Ooh. The eggs are in. They are in, my friend. <clears throat> I was on the train the other day, and this dude was talking about chickens, and he was like, Ask everybody about the male chickens. They are killing male chickens. They are right. So um, these are actually, uh, all these eggs are from a female chicken, which I prefer because I'm a feminist. I won't buy, I won't buy male products. And that includes chickens. I won't do it. I will not. So if you're like me and you're a girl, you want to keep everything good. So what you do, is you grab an empty glass, grab some cranberry juice. Cran grape drink champions! But it's just cranberry juice, there's no cran grape. I think it's kind of gross. Pour yourself a nice glass in the morning. Just to keep yourself fresh. You gotta stay fresh. Can't be one of those weirdos fishing it up. All right, the eggs are to the point where I can flip this bad boy. And what I do here, is I let the bottom kind of burn and then I break it up because then it's like all it's all ready and scramble them I still want them to be soft I don't get crazy some people don't scramble them this way it's easier for me so then I can do stuff while I'm scrambling them and they're done They're done. And this right here is called Sam's Breakfast. And I get it. I get it. The plate is extremely large. I know that. The plate is very large. Uh, it's simply because I forgot to wash the smaller plate that I usually have it on. So now it looks like I don't have much of a breakfast. But I have a breakfast. My favorite breakfast. My eggs and my bacon! Woo!